Hey guys, this is Kirob speaking and today we're back in the Cyclist Tactics with our career mode playthrough. Old Empire Racing, bringing glory to Ahana. And we are continuing our journey right there. And it is time to get into the Vitesse Spring Open, uh, which is a four stage stage race or tour. And that one is very mountainous. And that means it is Frank Weiss time. Ooh, who is still not doing all too hot, but uh, maybe his fitness peak will help us out. However, I also do have a bit of a plan lined up here, looking at these stages. Um, tell me if you notice something. So we have mountain rating there, mountain rating there, we have mountain rating there, sprint, sprint, sprint. Mountain rating, mountain rating, mountain rating, mountain rating, mountain rating. Can you tell me where the sprint points are? I can tell you. They are all here. In this little little bunch. <laughs> so um, it looks like whoever can win this stage is going to have a pretty good shot at getting the green jersey. Hmm, something to think about. Dennis Tarasov, who is a tier 2 time trialist. He might be able to uh, escape there if he saves enough resources on stage number one. Which is a short one, but he doesn't really have to go hard on it. Uh, we can just try to get him within the time limit and even have a support there to, to help him out. Maybe Vladimir can, can be there. And then um, Frank Weiss can be at the front and, and fight it out. But uh, yeah, on, sec on the second stage then... I think we have a pretty decent shot. 350, that's pretty long. Lots of cobble, no, non cobble sectors. Uh, technical sectors. Uh, or, yeah, a reasonable amount. They are quite stacked here, so it's not too severe. One there, a level three. Hmm. I think that's something to consider, at least. All right, let's get into it. But first things first, we should scout. And what are we looking for exactly? Maybe some more climbers, although we do have a few really good options in here. Uh, let's see if we can scout one that is just phenomenal first. And that will be Hedvesia, Mountain, that is plus energy per turn, minus attack per turn. Alright, let's scout that. And... Ooh... 10. Yeah. 5, 7. Interesting. That is a TT expert though. And that is a TT expert that is pretty close to leveling and has massive amounts of uh, attack points. That's quite interesting. Very fast without using those attack points, but this number here is awful. I think I'm going with Bronislav because his stats are pretty cool. Uh, yeah, very powerful, very, very fast, but absolutely atrocious recovery. Hmm. Yeah, okay, well, I'll take him. And now we're getting into the races. Sky race for the season. Looking quite uh, difficult, but no super brutal climb right at the end. So uh, it's more something for a puncher. Fausto Grassi. Uh, who was that? Why, why were there so few riders in this one? A Meadowmeister Milk. Um, two mountain, one downhill. Yeah, well done, mate. Uh, defeating... Uh, Nova Sports, Dino Lombardi. That is impressive. We are the top ranked team in this one. I think the others have much better riders though. Manuel Gomez, yes. <laughs> Ouch. Okay, well, uh, he's in here. That will be difficult to beat. Oh, also a rider of note is Frank Washington. Him being here as a level 3 downhill, it, that is that is brutal. He is really good on some of those stages. The last two, though, end on a big climb. So he's certainly not the favorite there. But this one is perfect for him. Frank Weiss not looking quite as bad as usual. Uh, he does have plenty of energy per turn now that he is on his uh, major fitness peak. Uh, and does have 14 attack points instead of 10. Not too shabby that either. Because I'm not one of the favorites whatsoever... I'm in a position where I can just ride along for a little while at least. I don't have any ambitions for this first stage apart from staying with the bunch 
or oh, well, some of the favorites, if possible, with Frank Weiss. I'm going to keep Vladimir in P2, just in case something bad happens and we need to react quickly to get to the front and pull somewhat. I'm wondering, though, in this situation, we've come a fair bit, they are moving quite hard across some of these sectors, and Sansa is already losing a fair amount of attack points. I do need him to have max attack points tomorrow, because that is the day where he's going to be the lead out for the rider who's going to win the green jersey, Dennis. So, I'm wondering if Dennis and Sansa should be pulling a uh, leisurely pace at the rear, maybe there. But I also need someone to uh, take care of Frank Weiss. So this is currently Vladimir's move. Um, and I'm going to um, follow along there. And then Frank Weiss follows along as well. While the others... Ah, perfect. Not using any attack points there. And Dennis go there. And then Dennis is going to... Ooh, they are coming forward already. Mm, okay. We need to watch out now. Um, let's start moving... Yeah, do we want to move him already? Uh, I'm not so sure. Maybe on the next turn? But there's some technical shit in the way anyway. And much more to come. Hmm. So do we want to spend two attack points on this? I don't think so. Let's keep it clean for now. And have them ride leisurely back there. Dennis can pull. He has a higher energy per turn. And in general also some downhill skill. Okay, that worked out. Just six. Six. Okay. And Dennis here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We're not going to go past there. Um, he's looking solid. So, yeah. Let's just go there. Yeah, still can't come forward. But I kind of need to. Because the next move is going to be there. So, yeah, fuck it. Uh, we need to. He can come forward one. Because he only spent... Uh, six energy of out of eight. The time limit, by the way, is still back here. So, no danger whatsoever. We can save some, some energy with the others. Yeah, big move. But one that is quite uh, acceptable in, uh, in terms of not using attack points. Oh, wow, what a move. Holy shit. Okay, that nuked quite a few. Uh, Max Bush is gone there. Yeah, he's a flat rider, so not surprising. But yeah, we can still follow without losing max attack. That's good. And another big move. Second to last one. Or is it? No. I don't think they're going to reach, are they? No, I don't think so. Uh, but that's a big one. Big jump. We've got to follow, though. Like this. And that's just a 7-3. So he could go too further, or would be able to if it weren't momentum blocked. And he also can't reach. That is unfortunate. But maybe the move is so hard. Is this... Uh, how many nodes is this? That would be 18, 17, 18. So that's three slipstreams, so no slipstream. Ah, okay. We're not going to get any slipstream. Oh. Okay, so far, Manuel Gomez, ah, we can reach that one. So it looks like they um, actually were not able to finish this turn. Okay, well, that's good for us. As I don't have any ambitions of winning this tour with Vladimir, I think I can start moving a little short here now and just drop off and save that energy. Let's go to the fiver here. And Frank Weiss... Oh, okay, he d does he get one slipstream there? He does. Okay. Well, um, then we shall just follow them. And we would be able to move up one, but then we can only... Sp well, we have four attack points, and yeah, we would be empty for tomorrow. Tomorrow is not a day where Frank really needs the attack points, though. So how about we go there... Because these guys don't look overly strong. And this is just a minus one in slipstream. So there will be some slipstream. But Manuel Gomez is right there. He's quite a bit faster. But I think I'm in a good position to have a chance at podium. 
as Manuel Gomez is, well, he's a sprinter. He can use eight attack points in total for uh, repositioning. Mm, I won't be outdoing him. Well, that's for sure. So let's just move up like this because that saves us uh, using an attack point. Let's join the relay. Pretend to be working. That probably is going to change, by the way. That, that is going to also cost an, uh, a point of resources. Oh, man. Okay. What? Uh, now that's bad. <laughs> I can nuke these guys. Have a nice attack move here. Oh, and I get I get back everything anyway. For the move. So let's do this. I'm going to be out sprinted and stuff. Yeah, I am. Completely wasted. But, uh... Ah, oh yeah, fourth. That's fine. I didn't pay for it, though. So it's good. Slowly inching my way up. Time limit currently is there. So I can just do three moves. And that should be all I need. I have been able to recover a little bit on the, on the flat there before as well. And, uh, yeah, let's, let's put in another one. Time limit creeping up, that is. And we have just finished. Beautiful. That is a very bad time, but who cares about time if you're trying to win the green jersey? Excellent result for Frank Weiss. Sixth place. He got out-sprinted there. I think the ordering might actually be wrong here. Because these two guys were left behind... I mean, they all have the same time, that is correct. But the ordering should be these two at the bottom and I'm in fourth. Not that it matters to me right now, but it sure matters to these guys here. Um, right, all right, summary, something to keep an eye on. Sixth place would only give us 32 prestige points. That's not great. But now recovery, that is more important right now. Frank Weiss doing well, he has five recovery as a stat right now. And Dennis is looking all recovered up nicely. Lost nothing there. And overall, looking like our strategy might be working on this one. As we are on full energy, I'm going to stay in P1 with the slipstream going on. So it's all penalized anyway, no slipstream there. And uh, dropping back on the move that first cost me any energy. That is way more efficient than dropping back now because that doesn't make up for the um, for a slipstream at all. And that's all fine. Um, we can now just sign off on this. Dennis is also going to stay here. Same with everyone. I don't plan on going out with an attack. I think here I really need to put uh, Vladimir up to the front because this is a headless peloton at the moment. Oh, yep. Yeah. Uh, you go there and everyone else. Go back, please. Now we're in the flat. It's still two escapees up front. But uh, no real danger I see here. He has a plus one in flat, which is fine. But he's already at kind of half-ish. Uh, no, not quite half. But two-thirds of his energy. Quite slow. And, yeah, not looking too worrying. Uh, and this guy who does have really good stats for what is to come. He is struggling a little in his uh, attack department, it looks like. Oh man, every time there is one of those technical sectors, they're going ham. Moving 20, costing us quite a lot of energy. Oh, of course, that is something that Sansa doesn't mind at all. all right, he's he's doing well. There you go. Uh, with this plus too technical that is then just if it's a two yeah medium section that is a penalty of two which then transforms into a penalty of three because they are in p3 and he cuts off two of that or compensates two of that so it's just a minus one penalty which is fine but still you you suffer for the uh, added slipstream penalty and another one of these big moves holy shit could you calm down please across these sectors that is nasty. Whoa, now they're really moving hard. This is quite nasty. Uh, that is a move of 22. And we need to start getting to the front because this is going to end poorly if we don't strike a little sooner rather than later. These guys must be getting a little low too on their speed. Yeah, not all of them. 
Okay, that was a more acceptable move, I have to say. Uh, 17. I don't quite want to catch him, and now would be the time to go out and strike. Because this is about 100 nodes left, 110-ish. And there's still an SKP up front, which we can easily overtake. There are the sprints, one, two. And then we have the run into the finish. And I'm not sure if we um, if we can attack this early on, or if we want to uh, wait until the favorites are up front and crushing it. Probably want to attack beforehand, so that they have a bit of a scuffle there with the, uh, their teammates and uh, can't really do what they need to. Um, so everyone move up to the front right now. Oh, they are coming. Oh, a few of them are coming. Ah, shit. Okay. Let's see. Um. Oh, they attacked. Okay. Uh, well, there was more more than one person fought that thought or that I had, I guess. Because this is a strong move. All right. We just need to follow that. We will be very heavy um, on our team in there, but we need to we need to go with it with those guys, Frank Weiss even, as well. That's quite the advantage we we get there. And don't forget, there's still quite a lot of people stuck back there in the penalty. Some leaders. And some of these guys are really empty. Huh. So whom do we want to do the pulling and whom do we want to take the green jersey? Maybe it's Sansa. Because he is still quite beastly here right now. And there's a technical sector in there as well. That might help him. His energy allows for about four turns of full movement. And his attack of three turns of... Well, three and a little bit of, um, of maximum movement. So, or maximum minus one, rather. Uh, so, let's do a bit of a checkup once we are on him. Um, but first, yeah, we have to estimate how far they're going to move. So, it is one turn across here. Then you go to there. Then you probably jump pretty deep into the hill. And then into the flat. And then, so it's five ish turns. And it's a little early. But we do want to have these points as well, don't we? Okay, I think I know what I'm going to do, or try to do. I'm not sure if this is going to be successful, because there's a Max Bush in here. Uh, so I'm going to fall back to behind these guys. I do want to get rid of some of those as well. So I'm going to try and attack. Vladimir, I'm not sure if he can set a pace that is scary enough. But Frank Weiss is going to go all the way behind as well. Uh, Dennis is... is he going to pull? Is he going to pull, do the first pulls here? And Sansa is the one who takes the jersey? Nah. Nah. I think I'm more of a fan of Dennis taking the jersey. But then Sansa needs to lead out. Uh, he, he's good at that. I'll give him that. He uses a lot of attack points too. And Sansa is looking really strong. Uh, he has a lot of energy left. But his attack would dwindle quite quickly. But he could do the initial pull, that's for sure. Or Vladimir. So let's um, do that with Vladimir first. Set him up as second if Vladimir is not capable of doing a max attack and that is good enough. And then we have Frank Weiss there who is just there. And uh, Dennis is last because he's our speedy boy. So uh, here we go. This is our setup. Let's see what happens. And they are going across, and that's not a strong move. Aha, uh -huh. okay, now that's a better move. Uh, Vladimir can do a pull, but what does that look like? Oof, that's a little weak. Um, um, I think, though, and we might be able to, from there, if we are there, that's a 5-6. If Sansa is leading this one out, then I'm pretty sure that we are quite easily going to... Oh, he would probably even get to there. Would he? So, let, let me check. Because 
Sansa has a plus one, so that gives him one further. Then he has six energy per turn, so that is one further. Then he has nine attack per turn, that is three further. So he should be getting to there. If that is the case, then we have the perfect, uh, the perfect super efficient way of getting over the climb next turn and getting all the sprint points along the way. So I think that's the way to do it, right? So uh, Vlad Vladimir is joining these guys, and let's hope my calculations are correct. Vladimir is joining these guys. Mark them. You're good there. And now we have Sansa, and no! No, I miscalculated! Fuck! <laughs> All right, he needs to go regardless. Uh, let me see, Dennis is only using two attack points. Yeah, that is strong. And Frank is getting some time on this as well. He can just join in. He can just join in the fun. Um, yeah, a bit of a chaotic situation, but I am certainly willing to take advantage of it. And this is not a great place to be, is it? Uh, next turn, yeah, he can get into there, even though he has a minus one in mountain. All right, let's go there. So Dennis takes two points there. That's fine. He doesn't sprint. Don't want to waste attack points. No, this is Frank, actually. Um, then maybe we do want to sprint with one. Yes, 22. Do we need to? Do we need to? If he's going to pull on the next one, then we probably don't need to. There's a minus four slipstream here, though. Mm, that hurts. That hurts. Uh, there won't be any slipstream, really. All right. Um, so he gets one point there. That's still fine. Because there are ten at the end. Peloton moving into a good place there, but we are quite far ahead. It is, though, still 70 nodes to go. It's quite a distance. Okay, Sansa, you have done pretty well, um, but I will need you for one final pull on another move. So let's um, move you back by one. And then, uh, Frank, do you want to pull? Nah, you need to be safe in the back. So you also move back. Well, that didn't make any sense then. And Dennis is going to go to the front. There you have it. He's now pulling. He's now pulling across those ratings while Vladimir is just marking all the other riders. Yep, there we go. Strong move coming up. Frank Weiss can't follow. Uh, Frank Weiss, can you follow please? Uh, yeah, okay, now everyone can follow to there, which is a good move. And I don't think they can reach. I really don't think they can reach to there. This is a little bit too far. If I have problems reaching to there, then from so many nodes before that, they shouldn't be able to. Okay, let's hope I did not underestimate them. Uh, so we move there. Dennis is taking three points. Like this, and the others are just following along. Max attack, basically. Yes, okay, they're moving short. This is the more efficient move, because it uses less attack points. But also, uh, gives the Peloton a chance to catch up. Look at that. Oh, they are. They are right there. <laughs> they don't have much left. So that was the right choice to get move into a, even, like, even if it wasn't a good spot, it allowed us to make the slightly inefficient jump, but we did make the jump. Um, to here, and that gives us a node advantage. I don't think they will be able to to offset. Now we have a situation here where Sansa can do a final thing for us, and that is power through that technical sector. So Dennis is going to go back. Sansa is... Yeah, he only has a minus one here. So he's going to power to there. Or maybe further, we, we shall see, but I don't think further. Um, that should be good. Frank Weiss, still hanging in. Let's just move him behind. Yeah, this is looking good. This is looking good. That's the move. Um, not going to go there. Only have six attack points left. Very easy to follow, too. We don't need to superpower this one now. This is not too far to go. Oh, they are coming, though. They are coming. Who's that? Oh, shit. Luigi Bernani. But you see what? They are landing 
so that they have the technical sector, the minus three sector, on their next turn still. So we are the only ones on the next turn who are not going to get this penalty. Good stuff. And Vladimir is going to take a little bit of a nap here, uh, because we don't need him anymore. Not for this stage. And now it's up to Denis Tarasov to do what he does best, and that is time trial. Yeah, with his teammates in the back. Let's see if they can hold pace. Whew, that's quite the pull. Sansa. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess we want to take as many points as possible over there. Fill the podium, something like that. Frank Weiss can follow, and Sansa can follow. But it is tough. It's five slipstream. That's a tw 28. <laughs> Holy shit, mate. That's quite fast. Starting from a 14 note, of course. So that's a 23, no, uh, 24 effective move on the flat, on a perfect flat surface. But uh, yeah, still, I appreciate that. Look how much farther they can move. Beautiful. Okay, no one here can challenge that. They are not going to go that far. Should give us a, a good advantage for Frank as well, for the coming stages. So there's Dennis, uh, and oh, yeah, Frank will be able to follow. I hope he brought his recovery, because this was a harder stage than he expected it to be. Let's hope this doesn't bite us in the ass later on. So we are moving across the line. Sansa can't follow there. Can he follow? No, it doesn't matter. Sansa can do whatever. Um... But the important thing is Frank Weiss actually could follow. So Dennis has done his job. He has green guaranteed if he can finish the other stages. And Frank Weiss doesn't even need his remaining attack points. Beautiful. There we go. Frank Weiss finishing second on the stage. And that is a minor sprint. Or a medium sprint, not a major sprint. So it's only seven points there. But we have gathered so many points otherwise and these are the only ones so that it doesn't really matter good stuff signing off there oh they were pretty close in the end i didn't expect them to be quite that close and across the line last but not least vladimir he did manage to uh, open up that uh, oh did he do he actually have yeah a little bit uh, moral support <laughs> So Frank Weiss is now the leader overall, but that uh, that benefit there will be kind of eaten up, especially after this stage, uh, which oh wow, look at that! We might might get might get some uh, some nice points for the sprint jersey there. Um, it might uh, it, this will get eaten up by some of the actual favorites on those future climbing stages, I'm sure. But it gives us a little bit of an edge for now something to to gnaw on while these others <laughs> are, are uh, just flying up the mountains and let's take a look at the stage summary oh yeah so fortunately this is a pretty pretty short stage sansa is shot uh he yeah it was it was a good move though that we did not try to make him the uh, the guy with green because that would mean that he needs to survive the upcoming stages and he is a candidate for really not surviving mountain stages frank weiss mostly recovered but not fully so this will be a tough one well yeah fortunately these are pretty short but this holy this will be tough this will be really tough and my other guys are all down there <laughs> Uh, but holding yellow and having a stage win. Beautiful. All right. I think we're going to end it here. And then in the next episode, see how this one resolves. Hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time.